Hello guys and ladies, this is Premium Milk. Here is a tutorial for the Gradient Transitions Pack for After Effects and Premiere Pro. On the zip file you will find the documentation where to copy here the Mogrid files for Premiere Pro. Here is the Mogrid files and also, also there is the After Effects file for uh, 2019 and above and also the ZXP that includes the Premium Builder Gradient Transitions Pack and here is the installation how to install the Premium Builder extension to your system. Download from After Effects Scripts dot com the ZXP installer install it on your system and then run ZXP installer like this here and just drag and drop the ZXP file here to install it for both After Effects and Premiere Pro after that you will open a After Effects let's see the After Effects version first and here on the window you will see on extensions Premium Builder Gradient Transitions Pack after that, you will see it will appear here. And here is the all the 100 gradients transitions. So, just double click like this. And here we have also to see where is the transition. So it's ready, you are able of course to get inside the transition and change the colors like this, color 1 and 2, to have another gradient like this. It's very easy to just, you just double click to bring the transition into your system <clears throat> if you like some transition you can click the start button in order to add it to, to your favorites and then you go to your favorites and you have the most um, transitions that you're using the most as you can see the transition they have some names transition one it means one color I mean two colors gradient but it's one and transition two uses two, two colors three four five and six so this is the way you import the transitions to your system to your timeline like this and Let's see now on Premiere Pro version. Here we have the same thing Windows, Extensions, Premium Builder, Gradient, Transitions Pack, and it's here. And also, if you copy the Mogrid files to an Essential Graphics folder, you will find them also here, but it's static. But of course, you can drag and drop like this. And also from the Premium Builder, you can see them in action. And then in order to double click, you have to lock the, this, uh, the timeline, this sequence here, in order to just double click after like this and to find where is the transition here. So we go here and open again and we have the transition. So this is how it works. Let's bring another one also. And also here on the CESA graphics, you can change the colors, of course. Let's bring another one like this one. Okay. Here it is. And here how you will change the colors from here if you want to take the same color you can use it like this so this is it it's very easy to customize the transition and to import them to your timeline both for Premiere Pro and After Effects 
So this is it. I hope you like it. Don't forget to rate. Thank you very much. Bye bye.